Hello and uh, welcome to my presentation today. Uh, my name is Babu and I work for Migrant Resource Center of South Australia, NRC, as a volunteer. Today, uh, the purpose of my presentation is to introduce uh, a, a change management plan uh, established under the strategic planning process, which seeks to redefine and improve the standard of settlement services provided to refugees and uh, migrants who are settled in Australia under Australian humanitarian uh, visas. Uh, my presentation provides a depth analysis on areas that need more improvement, including uh, case coordination, uh, <coughs> client management, and volunteer as well. Uh, my presentation outlines a uh, future direction for MRC's new case management, development plan, and implementation of the change process across all areas of organizational effectiveness and operational activities. Uh, my presentation will be guided by the content, by this content, as a guide to make you understand the new case management development plan. Before I go through my presentation, I would like to say something about MRC. Uh, I would like to introduce you about MRC. Uh, MRC, Migrant Resource Center, is an independent non-governmental organization, NGO, uh, committed to assist refugees and, and the migrants who are settled in Australia. Uh, MRC's vision is to enable migrants and refugees to have equal access of opportunity and participation in Australia. MRC is contracted out under Settlement Grant Program SGB by the Department of Immigration and Border Protection to provide a wide range of settlement services to migrants and refugees who are granted visas under Australian Humanitarian Settlement Scheme. Uh, since its um, formation in 1979, um, MRC has assisted thousands of refugees and migrants from a wide range of backgrounds to adjust their new life in Australia uh, to achieve an out, uh, and the organization's purpose is to achieve uh, an outcome of its services to be considered a high quality top uh, settlement services. Uh, the core settlement services provided by uh, this organization include its airports reception Reference orientations, adjustment, trauma counseling. Current service management, uh, and these services uh, are provided by this uh, uh, management system, uh, which includes case coordination, volunteering, client management. Context of strategic issues. MRC has faced strategic issues that might affect its internal and external processes due to high increased demands of settlement services uh, and operational ineffectiveness and service inefficiency. More than 30,000 asylum seekers have come to Australia uh, seeking asylum uh, from Australian government in 2010 and 2014. These issues has also caused the political tensions between Australian political parties, liberal and the liberals. The live recent take of humanitarian entrants from 13,500 to 20,000 per year has also increased the demands of settlement services. MRC was a small organization that relies on funds, the SGP, and other financial assistance from other government agencies. There is also uh, service inefficiency and ineffectiveness and poor uh, settlement services due to shortage of skills and qualified staffs. As a result of this, many clients have not properly received the right services for their settlement due to poor operational performance and complex uh, case coordinated systems in the areas of, settlement, of service delivery. All these issues uh, have affected the operational performance and effectiveness, uh, including case coordination, uh, volunteering, client management. Judge management agent. Uh, the judge management agent process is led by the author of this presentation, who is employed as an independent consultant and as well as uh, as employed as a uh, volunteer. 
MRC's annual organization and management performance report has identified gaps in case supervision, board coordination, slow service delivery, and underperformance in client management systems due to shortage of skills and staffs. More than um, um, the report, uh, uh, my presentation has, or uh, the report has also recommended uh, a lot of ways that need uh, to be changed and improved in the case uh, administration systems and some strategies to develop change management plan. However, MRC has called all the staffs uh, uh, to have their voice head on what the organization can do to improve settlement services, particularly the client management system. Therefore, the independent consultant uh, was approached and tasked to prepare a report of uh, change management plan, namely MRC's case management development plan. Uh, to launch this initiative, the presentation applies the strategic process undertaken to formulate and pave the way for this change management process to happen as designed. MRC's uh, new case management development plan was introduced as an initiative to replace the case coordination system. Uh, this new case management seeks to hire new talents and improve existing talents and their capacity to, to respond to current and future demands of settlement services effectively and efficiently. MRC uh, will hire more than 25 case managers and over 120 uh, volunteers from a wide range of backgrounds to assist the organization to serve for uh, its multicultural clients. This diagram uh, of the new case management development plan, uh, the cycle concerns the overall planning change uh, in the cycle and how it's going to be achieved. In the middle is the vision and how to get there is asking what we are doing, um, um, what we are doing, what internal capabilities we have. Do we have the right people, uh, like case managers, uh, case workers, or, or with the necessary skills, as well as volunteers helping to provide settlement services. Framing the issues. According to Bryson uh, 2011, uh, framing the issue is concerned with identification and understanding of the problems as well as developing mechanisms for a solution. Framing the issues of settlement services is how can MRC current management system, current management system be able to respond current and future increased demands of settlement services effectively and efficiently to, in, to meet organizational effectiveness and service standards and goals. Why transformation and change is needed? MRC's case management system is the central tenet of one of the organization's main core services, which ensures uh, settlement services being delivered to whom it's designed in a timely manner on behalf of Australian government's settlement scheme. The main reason uh, to change is to improve the systems of settlement service provision. Our settlement policy is a vital part of population and economic growth. Therefore, uh, the organization has not been able um, to respond effectively to the increased demands of settlement services due to shortage of skills, competence, and poor case coordinating system, which has impacted its operational effectiveness. However, uh, Porter 1996 defines operational effectiveness uh, doing the same or better than other organizations who are competing or are rivals. Therefore, transformational change um, might be needed as an approach to assist operational effectiveness to bring all resources together effectively and efficiently to improve operational activities in order to reach desired results. Uh, transformational change can be achieved by employing the right people with necessary skills to drive the change across the areas that need more improvement. Uh, the transformational change uh, can be failed if you employ the wrong people uh, or if you know the right you know, uh, uh, skills. 
strategic response. <laughs> strategic response can come after the identification of strategic issues. It's whole of, it's whole of organizational approach to develop good strategy to tackle with strategic issues and build a good strategy comes after good analysis. If strategic issues are not fully examined, then no strategic action can be taken. Best way to start a strategic response is to understand Bryson's 10 steps of strategic planning process. Bryson divides the strategic planning process as a strategy cycle which supports in the growing identification of the main activities of an organization. It's a participatory process by dominant coalition. To understand uh, uh, the steps of strategic planning, you can refer more to the practical reform, uh, to the practical, uh, uh, you know, examples, uh, to the report and handouts that you have got. However, the uh, best way uh, to identify strategic issues is to use Bryson's interrogative uh, techniques, uh, namely art of framing. What is the real issue or conflict or dilemmas? Service inefficient and ineffectiveness for coordination is located on service delivery, uh, <coughs> shortage of skills and competence in the management system, why is it an issue? The demands of settlement services are increasing as settlement policy is a part of economic and population growth and there is not enough comprehensive strategic response to tackle with this. Who says an issue? Senior managers, Department of Immigration, multicultural communities and media and other organizations. What happens if it's not addressed? The organization may lose its contractual arrangements with government and other uh, competing organizations might take over the services. Can we do something about it? Uh, transformational agenda can be a solution, I think, in areas um, identified as in most in need of improvement. Should it be broken down, we can employ uh, the best strategies to try to change process across the organization. What's missing? The right people direction, encouragement, motivation, and resources. Theoretical awareness. According to uh, Porter J.B. Uh, 2007, key steps should be done in the right way, in the right order, to make transformation and change happen successfully. Countries steps for change um, concerns uh, a key, you know, steps that should be followed in order to make the change, you know, happen successful. Um, establishing a sense of urgency, forming a powerful guiding uh, coalition, creating an efficient, uh, communicating efficient, empowering others to act on efficient, planning for and um, creating short-term wins, consolidating improvement and producing still more change. Institutionalizing the new approaches. Implementation of the plan. Uh, this is how, uh, this is the implementation of the plan and how the plan will be achieved. Um, uh, um, based on eight key steps of cultural strategic planning, uh, uh, eight key steps of, uh, of transformation and change. If you want uh, transformation and change to happen successfully, uh, this is the implementation plan and how it will be achieved. Um, you can refer more uh, to the report and the handouts. 
I thank you so much uh, for listening to my presentation. Um, if you have uh, any questions, um, you can refer uh, to my email, uh, which is nor triple uh, zero at industry.edu. Um, as well as um, this is the reference list. This, um, this is the materials that I've gone through in order to 